Hey there everyone! PUBG Mobile 2.1 is officially here. In this update, we've introduced a new arena mode, Ultimate Arena. After entering the game, select Unranked Arena, and you'll see the Ultimate Arena mode. Choose between two maps, Arangel or Livic. Ultimate Arena is based on the conventional arena, with the addition of a final circle mechanic. Players from both sides will undergo seven rounds back-to-back -back within a limited area, and the first team to win four rounds will be the ultimate winner. During the match, players can use their shop tokens to purchase weapons and equipment they require within a time limit at the beginning of each round. At the same time, random maps and weathers will rotate every round, and player movements will be restricted to certain areas within the map. For all participating players, this will be a new battle mode filled with excitement and challenge. In Ultimate Arena, familiarizing yourself with the battlegrounds environment will greatly affect the outcome of a match. In Orangel, when you encounter a map with loads of houses, you can use the complex terrain as cover to approach opponents and catch them by surprise. Meanwhile, on a map with no cover and lots of hills, you'll need to make the most of the terrain height difference to avoid taking damage. As Livic has a relatively more hilly terrain, it's easy to get ambushed by the enemy when fighting alone. So work with your teammates and use cover such as trees to avoid taking damage. Weather is also an important factor that will affect the outcome of a match. The sound of rain and rainy weather will mask the enemy's footsteps as they move, making it hard for you to detect their movements accurately. Therefore, you'll always need to remain aware of your surroundings, stay vigilant, and make use of cover as much as possible. Of course, you can take advantage of rainy days to attack with throwables. As enemies are also hampered by the weather, they're less likely to be able to avoid sudden incoming throwables. In foggy conditions, the low visibility makes it hard for both sides to observe their opponent's movement accurately. So you can set up cover with your teammates to avoid being blindsided when you lose sight of the enemy. At the same time, you can also seize the opportunity to strike the enemy with a fatal blow together. Although twilight and cloudy conditions have little impact on players, it's no time to be careless, and a certain degree of vigilance is still needed. In Ultimate Arena, shop tokens are the most important resource for players. At the end of each round, the system will award players shop tokens based on three aspects the current round, round outcome, and elimination results. The amount of shop tokens obtained from rounds is fixed, but differs depending on the current round, from round 1 to 6. Regardless of the round outcome, players will obtain 900, 1800, 1950, 2100, 2250, and 2400 shop tokens respectively. Shop tokens obtained from the round outcome will vary depending on if the player won or lost the round. In each round, winners get a fixed 450 shop tokens, while defeated players get 300 shop tokens. However, when defeated players are on a losing streak, the losing streak reward mechanic will be triggered. A two-round losing streak grants 900 shop tokens, while a three-round losing streak grants 1,500 shop tokens. Losing four rounds means losing the entire match. If the player wins a round and breaks the losing streak, the losing streak shop token reward will no longer be in effect. If the player's team loses again in the subsequent round, then the previous losing streak does not continue. Players that lost the round will only get 300 shop tokens as a reward. Elimination results also impact the number of shop tokens players earn at the end of a round, with 100 shop tokens for every enemy eliminated. If a player gets the first elimination, they'll also get a bonus of 50 shop tokens. According to this rule, if a player enters a two-round losing streak in round three, eliminates two players and manages to get the first elimination, they'll obtain a total of 3,400 shop tokens at the end of the round. Meanwhile, a winning player who has eliminated two opponents will obtain a total of 2,600 shop tokens at the end of the round. According to Ultimate Arena shop token mechanic, players can calculate the amount of shop tokens they'll potentially earn to better prepare for the rounds ahead. As it can be difficult for players to gain a shop token advantage from winning and losing rounds, how shop tokens are spent can mean a huge difference. At the start of a match, players are given a level 2 helmet, a level 2 armor, a P92, and 750 shop tokens. If you're confident in your own abilities, you can use a pistol to eliminate players and use the earned shop tokens to purchase a level 3 helmet and level 3 armor to improve your survivability. As for weapons, you can loot the equipment from your enemies to strengthen yourself. If you don't have enough shop tokens to purchase a weapon, you can also ask your teammates for help and pool your resources to create a super combat unit. You can also choose to spend all your shop tokens on weapons at the start. All weapons purchased in the match come with their own attachments. You can use your weapon's firepower to suppress the enemy and gain additional shop tokens from eliminations and wins to gradually fill the holes in your defense. Other than a variety of classic weapons, you can also purchase riot shields to provide cover for your team. When your team is on a map with less cover, riot shields can be extremely useful. In addition to knowing when to spend your shop tokens, choosing the right firearms is paramount as well. When your team is situated on a flat terrain with relatively little cover, the open terrain prevents both parties from acting rashly. When this happens, a sniper rifle with high damage at long range will come in real handy. In maps with many houses and complex terrain, you can choose to use an SMG with a high rate of fire and stable recoil in tighter combat areas to gain the upper hand in head-on confrontations and ultimately attain victory. That's all for this video. If you wish to know more about Ultimate Arena, don't forget to follow the official PUBG Mobile community. See you next time!